who are to be up kind of like no mm -mm. I look like Madame Curie Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do a get ready with me. Today is my husband and I's one year married marriage anniversary. Anniversary? Anniversary? And I just want to do a get ready with me. We're going to go on a date to some restaurant. And um, yeah, so I want to look nice. What you mean? Okay. And I'm using a styrofoam cup because we had a little get together yesterday and I had to do a lot of dishes and I'm not trying to do that today okay so I'm going to use my modern renaissance palette and he got me this for our anniversary finally every time when I wanted to get it and he was like agreeing to get it for me um it was always sold out or the store didn't have it and I didn't feel like buying it online because I didn't want to pay for shipping so of course I am priming my eyelids Whew. oh my god I'm priming my eyelids with my Tarte Shape Tape. You can prime your eyelids with whatever you want, I don't care. I'm going to go in with my Wet n Wild Crease Blending Brush and I'm going to use the color Burnt Orange. I just went in with a darker color and didn't even tell you. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with this color, Reglar, and do the same thing. Um, I'm just put it in my crease. So I'm just gonna go in. This is like an Urban Decay thing. I was gonna use my Elf, but they're dirty right now and they're drying. So I'm going to go in with the color Venetian Red, and I'm going to put that in my inner corner and my outer corner like this. I'm gonna go in with this color love letter and I'm going to put that in my inner corner and outer corner Then I'm going to go in with this color Primavera and again I'm just going to use the bottom. You can just use any flat eyeshadow brush for it but all of mine I washed them except for this one. So I'm going to use this. My poor professional primer. I feel like I have my pores are really bad right now. I'm just going to pat that in right here where I have the biggest pore. So I just went in with my Born This Way 
foundation. I really need to get a new foundation. I, I can feel that I'm running out. Like, I can't see it, but I can feel it when I'm pumping it. And I've had this for, like, a year. It lasted me a very long time. I've used, I use it, like, almost, not every day, probably, like, three times a week. It's a really good foundation. It's only, it's medium to full coverage. Like, it, it can be built up, but I don't like the way it looks when it's, like, full coverage. It looks, it's very, it's a very dewy. So, I don't know, it just looks kind of cakey. I'm gonna go in with my, sh um, Tarte Shape Tape. And I'm just gonna use a little bit, because a little goes a very long way with this. I don't know if I want to put it on my nose. Just a little line. A little bit on my forehead and dot on my chin. Yeah, the restaurant that we're going to, I haven't been there before. Um, we don't really go out to eat a lot. So when we do, we tend to go to really, really nice restaurants. My husband, he used to work in a really nice restaurant. So he knows, you know, the good ones around town. And this one is like, it's like tapas. So, we're going to go to this other restaurant called Mana, which is like a super nice restaurant. We have been wanting to go there for like two years, but anytime when we want to go there, we end up making up an excuse to go somewhere else. And we were going to go for our anniversary. It was kind of like set. But then we looked at their menu, and I was just like, let's just not go there because the restaurants that we tend to go to, it's like $100 for two people. But we never go out to eat, so that's our way of kind of making it feel better. Like, oh, we're not going to go out to eat for like another month or so. And their entrees that they had, I really didn't like them that much. They were, um, they had like duck, which I don't really, I might, I, don't, I like duck, but I, I don't prefer duck. They didn't have normal like chicken or beef, it was just like duck, lamb lots of seafood stuff and that's a lot of stuff that I don't like so I was like I'm not gonna pay a hundred dollars for a meal that I'm going to eat but not really enjoy like if I'm gonna pay a hundred dollars I'm gonna enjoy that meal this can be the best meal of my life now I'm shine and then I'm going where's my Cody airspun I'm going to go in with my Cody airspun I love this but it does have silica in it um, and silica when you take flash pictures like like, let's say you're gonna go to the club with your friend, with your girls, or your boys, and um, you wear um, an under eye setter or just a whole face setting powder and it has silica in it. What's gonna happen is if you use flash photography, it's gonna flash back, like, so it's gonna look you can see the powder under the person's eyes. And it's not like, oh, they didn't blend it off or, like, they didn't even take that off. And that's not why. It's because it has silica in it and it, silica just, like, has, like, flashback or something. I don't know. But I don't go out. And for, like, the price of it, I love this one. The only one that I like more is the Laura Mercier. But it's, like, $32. <laughs> and I had bought this, like, the little travel-sized one. The Queen of travel size. But it was $23 and I ran out of it fairly fast because I really liked it. So I was like, why am I going to pay $9 less when I could just pay $9 more and get way more? You know what I'm sa saying? You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm just going to take Endless Summer by Too Faced and just bronze up my face a little bit. Not look so pale. Tarte Party Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush. I don't know if you can see it. Oh well. And it's like this. Oh, the little thing came off. And I'm just going to put it on my upper. Um, let me put on some mascara. I'm going to go in with my L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara. Use this. This 
so I can see I need. So I'm going to use my Eyelor Vol Volume False Eyelashes. I was going to use my Dramatic ones, but I really want my husband to see my beautiful eyes. So let me take my, where is it? Right here. I'm trying to hurry because I think my phone's about to die. Okay. And later on today, I don't know if it'll be like before we go out to dinner or afterwards, we're going to do a what we've learned being married in a year card. This hopefully the second one isn't giving me a hard time like the other. Can we talk about this lighting? I don't know how I feel about it. Is it good? Is it bad? I think it's all right. Okay, it's all right. Oh, it's just the shadow that makes it look on camera. It looks like my eyes are like really like s domed in the middle part. Okay. <gasps> I forgot to prime my eye when I did. No, I didn't. Oh, I forgot to set it though. Mm. Oh well. Who cares? I'm just going to fix my eyeshadow really quick. Just because it did get a little bit messed up while I was struggling with my eyelashes. Hmm. Okay. Now I'm going to get these two colors again, Venetian Red and Love Letter, those two red colors, and pop them underneath my bottom lash line. Alright, so I took a break because I realized I didn't shave my legs, so I shaved my legs because I wasn't trying to be hairy. So I don't even know where I left off. And no, I didn't take a shower. I just like shaved my legs. You know what I mean when you're in a rush, even though I'm not really in a rush. So I don't know what I'm going to do for a highlighter yet or even if or if I want to do a highlighter, which of course I want to do a highlighter. Is that even a question? Um... Let me just fix my eyebrows real quick because they look really bad. Like I said before, I'm not a makeup artist. I don't know how to do half of the shit I'm doing. This is just how I like to do my own stuff. So just don't bully me, okay? Because I ain't here for it. You will get shut down real quick. I'm kidding. Let me stop. Oh my gosh, you guys probably think I'm so ratchet. Okay, sorry again. I changed to the dress that I'm wearing. I guess I'll show you, but it's so... Don't judge me. It's just, um... I don't know what kind of dress this is. I got it at Forever 21. It's like this. Don't look at my fat ass stomach. Because it stops here. It's a blush pink. It looks more like a cream in the camera. Ooh, 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 ooh. Kill it. Okay. <laughs> So, you guys know this is my favorite highlighter in the whole world. Besides, actually, I really like a lot of highlighters. I love highlighters. But this is just my go-to. I don't know which colors I should go with. I'm going to go with champagne. This champagne. I don't even know if it has a name. It's just the one I call. Champagne. And put it right here. I was going to use my Alchemist one, but I felt like this eye look didn't very, didn't look good with that. But I'm considering putting it in my inner corners, one of the, the pink one from the Alchemist palette. Put it on there, like tip my nose. Don't care if you guys can see my texture. I like highlighter on my nose. I know a lot of people don't like it, but I do, so I will. Make sure it's there. Ooh, 
Ooh, glowing bitch. I'm kidding. Let me stop. What am I? Who am I? Not Jeffree Star. Even though I would love to be. Okay. 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 And do I want it to do a Cupid's bow? So I can accentuate my mustache. Yes, I know I have a mustache. I'm Hispanic, hello. I don't know. And then I'm gonna use the little lippy that came with my Sephora thing. It's called. It's Tarte. What is it called? Birthday suit. So I'm just going to put that on. It looks the same color as my lips, so that's cool. Sorry. It really accentuates my wrinkly lips. And I feel like people judge me because I judge them. No, I'm just kidding. I don't. Don't do that, people, okay? It's just a sign that you're unhappy with yourself. I've noticed, like, a lot of people when they're like, oh, my God, look, I heard this. So they're like, oh, they can't, they have, like, certain pet peeves about people. Like, oh, my God, I hate when people do that. That's my biggest pet peeve. And I'm like, you do realize your pet peeve is something that you have an insecurity about yourself. That's just my theory. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. So I went in with this Wet n Wild Coal crayon. As you know, Wet n Wild is my favorite. Calling your buff. It's just a nude eyeliner and I put it on the lower um, waterline to kind of open up my eyes because I felt like with these eyelashes, it just made my eyes look really small. And, you know, you can use white, but I just used a nude to make my eyes pop just a bit. And I'm going to go in with more blush because I feel like I don't have enough now. And I'm going to go in with that tart one that I used with a stippling brush, just kind of. Go in like that. Ooh, I like the way I look. But I still don't know what I'm going to do with my hair. And I don't know if I'm going to wear heels. I'll probably wear some flats because I'm a little bit in heels. Like, I'm just way too tall. And I feel like I can't, like, my husband's, like, right here and then I'm, like, right here. <laughs> Anything else? That's it. We're done. Then I'm going to spray my face with my hydrating coconut water. Again, because it's just like that. My setting powder just makes my face really dry looking. And this just gives it more of like a hydrating look. Like, oh, fresh. Yes. Clean. Okay, that was just extra. I felt like uh, Jeffree Star when he's like, setting spray. And now I understand why he does that so much. Because it really feels like you're hydrating your skin. Like your skin is just alive again. What do you guys think? I, I feel like this light, ooh, um, kind of makes it hard to tell. I was going to wear these pearl earrings, but I lost them. My grandpa gave me them, and I'm kind of freaking out because I lost one. I wore it yesterday. Or did I? I wore it the other day. What should I do with my hair? Keep it down. It's like, like I said, my hair is wavy, and it's messy. Look at this. It's a mess. And I don't want to straighten my hair, and I didn't have time to curl it. So what should I do? Leave it down. I think it looks nice. Left it down, right? No? I don't know why I'm saying it like you're right here. Like, no, it looks terrible. Take it down. Leave it back up. I don't know what I'll do. I feel like I like it down. But then I feel like I also like the way it looks like up in a really nice bun. I'm going to keep it down. I'm going to pop in some pearl earrings. And that is going to be my look. Again, I was going to name this a get ready with me, but I don't know if it is. Later on today, um, my husband and I will film what we've learned in being married for a year. And I guess kind of like some advice that we would give to people. Um, you know, I can't give a lot of advice because, again, we've only been married a year. But I feel like you do learn a lot in a whole year. So if you liked this look, 
do you do you like it then please give me a thumbs up comment down below what you would like me to do next and don't forget to subscribe bye guys <laughs>